Live your life within the moment, moment. And don't go wait until the morning, morning. You never know when it is over. Oh. Hello, everybody, and good morning. It's Monica Tranter, and we are in beautiful Estepona, Spain, uh, just outside of Marbella. Um, and today we are doing the ball workout. Do, 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 do. So, all you need, ball, mat, get some water. A couple things that I'd like to uh, just have you keep in mind when, we're, when you're doing any kind of ball workout. Um, you can always uh, lose your balance. So if you need to put yourself beside a chair or a table, something that you can hold to sturdy yourself and give you that balance, then do that. And also, one of the important things about a ball is the closer you have it to your center, your core area, the more in control that you'll be, like anything. When our arms are out here, they're out of our control. When they're here, they're more in our control. Think about the same thing with the ball. So anytime we're doing work, uh, leg work, where your legs might be, uh, have to push out and in, if you think that going out as too far is going to hurt your back or hurt your hips or anything like that, then you just do less. Keep it closer to your center. So I'm just going to push hard into that. And so today we're going to get started with our Pilates ball workout. Okay, let's go. First thing we're going to do is just start with a bit of a warm up. I'm going to sit the ball down. I want you to get onto the ball. Okay, legs hip width apart. Okay, hands can be here, here, whatever's comfortable for you or just here. And I want you to think about just rolling around. Let's just loosen up those hip flexors. Get that back ready for your workout. Good. I'm doing eight to the right. And we reverse to the left. Try to get nice big circles, nice articulation through those hips. And breathe. And just take in the beauty. Arms out in front of you. I want you to think about tucking under and then arching back. Okay, so you're doing a bit of a tip and a tuck. So you're tipping under and arching back. And under and back and under and back and under. Good. And back. Now the same thing. I want you to put your hands down by your side. I want you to take your legs out one at a time, reach forward to the toe, give it a bit of a stretch, bring your head down if you can. If you need to put your hand on the ground, you can do that as well. <sighs> Breathe into that stretch. <sighs> Good. Bring your body up and we're going to switch legs, let that leg come out. Same thing, hand can go here, reach down, head in. If you need to put your hand down, put it down. Breathe into that stretch. Good. And roll up. We're going to do the same thing, taking our leg out to the side. One leg out. Open up those hips. Reach over. Just reach over. Lean, uh, lean on to the other leg. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, I feel good in this stretch. Be happy to get your day started. Something so amazing in getting up early in the morning and seeing the sun rise and getting a good workout in. Another way, people. Good, and again, try not to lean forward. Try to go directly over to the side. Good, feel a good stretch. If you want more, push open those hips. Just breathe. Stretch it out. Good. Oh, that feels so good. Open it up. Bring the legs back together. Easy, easy. Now I want you to think about we're just going to warm ourselves up a little bit. Arms up. Good, reach and open. 
and up and open and now when you're bouncing you're not doing anything here you're not slouching your belly buttons to the spine nice strong core just using the legs up and open good up and open one more time up and open awesome good one arm one good two let's just do three four eight because we're gonna do some arm work in a bit just getting us ready for that other arm keeping the belly button engaged good seven eight I want you to take the arm up and over let the weight of the elbow take the head over belly button to spine don't change other way now i'm really fortunate because i can hear the waves in the back the beach is at my backside here everybody's starting to get up the birds are chirping i want you to go to that happy place whatever it is for you and just breathe into that moment as you stretch now here i want you to let your elbows fall forward and now contract and open up and extend and contract and open up and extend yes arm across and back great open arm across ah oh, yes and back and up fantastic just give those arms a shake loosen that up one last bit and get a drink if you need to otherwise we're getting our mat moves on and we're going to get our wellness stop going right now okay everybody we're here i've got my ball i have decided to take my shoes off okay um, that just will give me maybe some more stability, but if you feel good with your running shoes or a kind of Pilates sock with a grip, then put those on, okay? So I want you to take your ball. I want you to lay on your back and place the ball onto your legs, okay? Arms, elbows into your side. I want you to inhale here for nothing. Exhale, belly button to spine, pulling it down, and we're going to ab prep up, okay? And back. Five times. Keep the shoulders down. Don't let your hips change position. Last one. Good. Take it in your arms. We're going to do five with our arms, uh, the ball off of our legs. Inhale. Exhale up try to really increase that she shape <sighs> pulling the belly button to the spine <sighs> one more <sighs> great now we're going to take our hands behind our head and up just to warm up for the roll up now i don't want you to let the body tilt at all okay nothing happens here your core is engaged your zipper is done up here okay ribs are closed inhale the arms go back exhale they come up you bring them back as far as you can without hurting your own shoulder good good One more. Good. I want you to take the leg out. Feel a stretch there. Good. Other leg. Now keep those legs locked and flexed and think about keeping the heels on the ground. Arms go behind you. Inhale. 
Exhale, rolling up. All the way up. Reach it all the way over. And rolling back. Okay, and only go as high as you can. If you inhale here and exhale just to here, that's okay. Right? But try to come up and reach out of that back all the way over. Inhale, exhale. Oh, that's great. Inhale, exhale. Try to get a little taller, roll over. Head in, oh, stretch it out. Inhale, exhale, rolling back. Inhale, arms above. Up. And reach over. And rolling back. Remember to drop your shoulders all the time. And excellent. Okay, we're going to bring this here. Now, we have two choices. You can keep it here to do the hundreds and just extend the legs either at a 90 or out. Or put the ball between your legs and we're going to work on the hundreds from here. You still need to make sure that you're not here, that you're at a 90 degree angle. So you're going to inhale for nothing. Exhale up. And one. I like the fist because it gives you focus. Every pulse, you're pulsing into your lats. Pulling the shoulders back. Good. Belly button to spine. Squeezing the ball, working those inner thighs. Squeeze. Almost there. Amazing. Great. Take the ball out. Oh, if you need to have a little stretch, just take the leg down. Switch. Good. It's a little stretch out. Now you can arch the back. Good. Bring the leg up one at a time. Good little stretch and roll, whatever you need to do to get yourself in that right position. Okay, now we're going to try to do a rolling like a ball. Where's our ball? Oh my God. Here we are. Okay, you can use the pressure of the knees. Now, you inhale here into that C shape. Okay, bottom up. Inhale back. Hold the ball. Use the pressure of the ball against the knees to really work those arms. Feel the abs working. Good. Very good. You should feel your arms, your abs, everything working here. It's harder than it looks, people. <laughs> And up. Good. Stay up here. Let the legs extend. Ball out. Let's just do a bit of a spine stretch forward here. Reach. Middle of the back back. And up. This is not a huge stretch forward. This is just a spine stretch forward, so it's small. Inhale. Exhale. And up. Inhale. Exhale. And one more. Inhale. Exhale. Good. Now you can take your ball, get it on the mat, give your legs a wider stretch. Okay, I'll do it from the side. Take your legs as wide as you can. I want you to think about rolling forward, stretching out the back. Good. And rolling back. And rolling forward. Let the head come in. And rolling back. And again, a little bit further this time. Reach it, reach it, reach it, reach it, reach it. And up. I know it's early. Okay, one hand, okay? So we're going to keep the hand here. I want you to reach towards that leg. You're going to feel a nice side stretch. And up. 
and reach towards this leg. Nice side stretch. And up. Same idea. Every time reaching a little further. Reach, 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 reach. And up. Good. Switching hands. Other way. Reach. Oh, good stretch, everybody. And up. Reach. And up. Last one. Reach. Good. And up. If you want to just leave the ball for a minute and just try to take a couple minutes just to stretch. Okay, a little bit of a bounce here, a little roll. Good. All right, shake those legs out. Shake those legs out and we are about to continue on with a little bit more leggy work. Ready? Here we are, I want you to lay back down. And we're going to rest our legs on our ball. And that's it. Okay. You wish. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Now, again, remember what I said. If you put your legs way out, it's going to be a lot harder. If you have any back problems, any hip flexor issues, any shoulder abdominal issues, I want you to keep it closer. Okay? So you're going to inhale for nothing. Exhale, belly button to spine, okay? This is a ripple up. It starts from the bottom up. Pushing on the ball, lifting up, extending up. Feel that working under here, really connected to those hamstrings and into those abdominals. And rolling down. Good. Inhale, exhale up, connecting those hamstrings into those glutes. Try not to use this too much. And down. And push up. Good. Breathe. And down. And one more up. Breathe. And down. And good. Now I want you to push up. I'm going to move my ball a little bit to give me a little bit more work with my legs. Just let your head go to the other side for a minute. Okay, here we go. Same thing. Belly button to spine. You're pushing up. You're bringing it in. You're pushing it out. And you're lowering down. Okay? So, inhale. Exhale. In. Out. Feel those hamstrings. That's a good one. And again. Inhale up and in and out try to not let this lower if you need to give a bit of support give a bit of support good inhale exhale up in and out and rolling down now we're going to push up and we're going to push in and out um three times while we're up there okay keeping our hips in the bridge position, in that pushed up position. Again, if you need to use your hands, use them. We don't need to hurt ourselves or be heroes when we're doing these exercises. These are hamstrings, working our hamstrings. Okay, inhale, exhale, rolling up. Get in your position, whatever it is, if it's here, that's okay. Otherwise, you're coming one, two, don't let this move, three, and rolling down. Oh, yes, people. Good. Inhale. Exhale. Rolling up. Doing great. And one. Two. Do it slow if you need to. Three. Good. And rolling down. We're going to do just one more set. Let that relax on the in-between. Inhale. Exhale up. Really reach it up, and one, and two, and three, and rolling down. Amazing. Give yourself a big hug. Pull this in. Stretch out that lower back. Keep that ball with you. 
Okay, if you need to do one leg at a time, let's do that. A little stretch here. Oh, yes. Good little stretch here. Flex. Oh, yes. A little stretch to the side. Always helps. And in. Other leg to the side. And in. Hold the ball. Open up. And excellent. Okay, now we're going to do the same thing. Resting. Okay, we're going to roll up. And I want you to think about extending if you can. One. And down. And two. And down. And three. And four. Five. Good. Roll down. Here we go, rising up, exhale, and here we go, and one, two, keep this working, three, four, five, and rolling down. Good. Now, we're just going to do some simple things. I want you to try to pick this up with your hamstrings, okay? So you extend and grab. The lower abdominals working. Good, grab. Try to get those lower hips off the ground. Or your buttocks, I mean. If you want to bring your hands in for extra curl. Seven, good. One more. And rest. Oh, fabulous. I want you to come up. Just roll over to the side. Take your legs off. Bringing your body all the way up. Okay. Let this come around you. And now we're going to do some other fun, exciting Pilates ball work. This again is going to be for abdominals, arms, legs. Full body. That's what we need in the morning. We need to kickstart this entire body, especially as we get a little bit older. Okay, I always like to just allow myself to just fall over the ball. Rest here. I want you to dig your feet in and extend your legs and let your body fall a little more forward. You should feel a nice stretch in the back if you have a tight back. Good, just give it a little roll. Really just dead weight on the ball. Sometimes that dead weight, if you do have a back condition, can really be um, painful, only because it can offer a pretty deep stretch. <sighs> Breathe into those areas. I want you to let one leg straighten. Move those hips. The other leg straighten. Good, same thing. Good, everybody. Just really feel it, really enjoy it. The ball is actually such an amazing, you know, extra piece of equipment. And it really does allow for a lot of support. Okay. So, our legs can be a little bit like a hip width apart. I want you to put your hands on the ball gently, elbows resting, okay? We're just going to do some uh, back extensions. So, body's going to fold forward. On the inhale, watch your balance, and exhaling up. Good, pushing up, and inhale forward. You want to let your knees bend on the inhale, you can. And exhaling up. And inhale forward. And exhaling up. And inhale forward. And exhaling up. One last time, inhale forward. And exhaling up. And fabulous, good. Now, we're gonna put our hands on the floor. We're going to move this to support our belly a little more, okay? 
So this is as if we're kind of planking, but we have the ball to support us. So all we're going to do are some leg, we're going to start with our leg lifts, okay? So you can go here, or you can go here. Whatever is comfortable for you. Belly button to spine, do not let that body sink, keep it supported. And one. And two. And three. And four. I keep that foot flexed. Five. And six. Belly button to sign. And eight. Other side. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Good. Seven. And eight. Good. Same thing with a bend. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Don't put too much weight into those arms. Really try to use the stomach. Other leg. And one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. And good. Okay, I'm going to take the back, stretch this up, give a stretch like downward dog. Stretch out the back, bring the ball back a bit. Round the body up. Okay, now we're going to put more of our hips on the ball, okay, and we're going to do our scissors. So try to get those legs super straight, belly button to spine, and beating those legs in one. Six, seven, eight, two. Good. Three. Four, two, three, four, five. Five. Six. Good. Seven. That's it. Eight. Good. Parallel your legs. Now that was a turnout. Now we're going to parallel them. And we're going to do the same thing. One, two, three. Four. It's a little bit different feel. Two. Three. Four. Five. Belly button to spine. Six. Seven. Keep them parallel. Last one. Eight. Great. All right. Moving our hands a little bit forward. We're going to take this into a push-up, okay? So you're going to go down, elbows in, and up. If you want more work, take your arms out forward. Bring the ball a little bit further down. If not, keep yourself supported and keep it near your center, like I said in the beginning. Okay, so we're going to do five. And here we go. One. Two, three, elbows down, shoulders relax, good, and take a breather, and another set, and one, two, three, four, five, good, breathe, and one more time, take it down. Two. Let the momentum of the ball help you. And five. And up. Okay, we're going to do something a little bit more difficult, okay? So it's also for the arms. So you bring your body back and down. And up like a roll. Back and back. Elbows stay down. Back. And back, and back, now reverse, down and back, and four, and down, up, and down, elbows in, always up, don't forget about those legs, keep them supported, up, good, down, back, up, good, reverse, back, in, up, and back. In, up. 
you to start to fill those arms. Up. In. Up. Fantastic! Let's kick into some ab work. I'm going to get you to bring this behind you a little bit further. Okay, put the foot on. So find your balance first. Find a good balance here, okay? Now, bend yourself down, get your feet on the ground. Then walk it out, get both feet on there. Okay, so all I want you to do at this point, once you get in that comfortable position, all I want you to do at this point is get into this comfortable position, okay? Stretch out that lower back. And I want you to put the legs out and in. And belly button does not sink. Out and in. And out. Good. In. Three. We're going to do eight. And in. Four. And five. And six. And seven. And eight. Now, we're here. Hold it here and pop it up. One. This is abs working. Belly button to spine. Three. Good. Four. Five. Six. Tuck it in. Seven. Watch out for that ball. Eight. Bend it in. All right. Take this leg here. Other leg here. I want you to grab the ball and just stretch. Okay. Now. Fabulous, you guys are doing great. Let's take a side knee, okay? Let's just stretch that out from all the work we did here. Okay, let's just reach up and over. Grab if you need to. Good. Up, over. We're going to let the side of our body come onto the ball, so just get comfortable. Just get in that comfortable position. Okay, we're gonna work some outer thighs. You can have your hand here, you can have it here, you can have it here, whatever is comfortable for you. Okay, and up and down. One, two, three, good. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Good, hold it there. Out one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, and down. Let your body relax. Good, and again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and out. One, two, Three, even though the ball can move on you, just keep your balance. Get your core in. Six, seven, eight, and in, and out. Okay, I want you to try to get both legs out. Okay, if you need to take the one leg back, up, stretch it right back, reach up to the sky, let the ball hold you. Look, the ball is holding me. Think about your day. Think about how fabulous your day is going to be. Oh, everything you're going to accomplish today. Think about your greatness and where you thrive. Oh, push those hips up. Fabulous. Let's get to the other side. Everybody, same thing. Have a little stretch. Reaching over. Yes, fabulous. I love it, I love it, I love it. Oh, oh. oh my god, I can't stretch enough, I feel. Okay, same thing, right? Arm is going over to the other side. You're going to find your stability. Get that knee down. Again, oh, oh my gosh, yes, yeah, see? Everybody can get a little all over. Okay, leg is going to come in. Again, hang here, here. I keep it here. And here we go. 
up for eight, a couple of sets in one, two, three. Belly button to spine. Don't forget to breathe. Six, seven, eight, and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and down. Rest, a little stretch, and again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good. Down. Reach this leg out. Arms up. Take the leg back. Feel the weight of your body on that ball and reach up to the sky. Reach back. Push those hips forward. Feel that wonderful full side stretch. Ah, amazing. Okay, everybody. Let's take ourselves over the ball. Mm, let your body rest. Okay, we're going to go into child's pose. Just let the body roll forward. Other arm through. And back to center. And the other arm through. Nice side twist. And back to center. Good. I want you to take the step up. Legs hip width apart, further than hip width apart. Stretch. Let's lose the ball. Arms down. Reach to the side. Up. Reach to the other side. Up. Bend in. <laughs> Ball's too far away. Bend in. To have a nice seat on the ball again. We're going to finish up with a nice couple stretches here. Use the ball for support. <sighs> Reach it out. Good. Take the arm up and back. If you can't do this because you're worried about the balance, that's not a problem. Just hold whatever position you can. If it's here, hold it. Let's switch. Other side, same thing, extend that back leg, really push that hip through, reach it out, and extend it up, oh that feels good, good, and if you can, I like to walk it around, and I like to roll myself just in the full open position. Let the body relax and push it back. You have the ground here to hold yourself if you need to. And forward and back. And in. Good. Bring the arms back. Reach. Stretch everything out. And reach, stretch everything out. Good, reach, stretch everything out. Perfect. If you can bring yourself in to grab a leg, we'll just do that. Keep the support of your body. Good. Same thing on the other side. Use the ground. Side. Use the ground. Support your body. And fabulous. Well, everybody, we are all done for the day. Thank you for joining me. 
in this wonderful Pilates mat class. And I hope whatever you do today is going to be amazing because you're amazing, right? And there's only one you. So get out there and just go do it. Whatever it's going to be, it doesn't matter what the circumstance is. Take the power that you've gained from this class today. Take it into the rest of your day. Go with energy, go with intensity, and you will have success. I promise you that. Have a wonderful day. And until our next wellness stop and our mat moves, we'll see you soon. Live your life within the moment, moment.